Thank you for tuning in to another edition of the Vulcan Report. This end of day Bitcoin report is for trading on Monday, August the 8th, 2016. Taking a look here at the Bitcoin chart, currently Bitcoin is trading at 589.78. You can see here that the market is still in a negative pulse wave downtrend channel. The question would be is the market going to test the low here of last week before uh, retracement back up again or is it going to just try to be quiet and just trade within this uh, very wide range well on the long-term chart here looks like the market is setting up for the next breakout at 682.65 so that's what you're looking at on the weekly chart so it's a continuation pattern that's developing right now looking switching to the daily chart you can see how the market spiked here at this low all right and then it managed to climb back now it still has overhead resistance at 600 and then again right here at around we'll call it uh, we'll say 615 all right on the daily chart you're looking at up resistance it's about 620 620 621 all right, if prices can get above, you know, get to there and break that, then that triggers your next long that'll take you up to the 650 and then a possible retest of 700. As it is right now, though, on the daily chart, you're still in a negative pulse wave. You're just in a retracement of that negative pulse wave. But the downtrend channel has not been violated. And uh, right now in the market, even though it ceased going down, it's still in a situ in a vulnerable situation where this could see itself being sold off, um, you know, in a, in a massive way. So we're gonna have to wait and see and, and see what can happen here. Can uh, Bitcoin catch some catch a bid here this week, or what's going to be the case? But as it stands right now, uh, Bitcoin is plagued. The cryptocurrency markets are plagued with with rampant fraud and, and abuse, all types of shenanigans right now, which should not be happening, especially for a market that, you know, prides itself on being totally different than, you know, Wall Street and, you know, our, our U.S. markets or in the global markets for that matter. It's supposed to be free of the um, collusions of the central banks, etc., and right now that's not what we are seeing in my prior video I did I did prove I did show you uh, a lot of problems that uh, the cryptocurrency market is having right now and it's going to have to shake that off it's gonna to have to deal with that and I don't I don't see a, a, a solution outside of regulation which right now <laughs> this uh, wild wild west doesn't seem to be very well regulated at all it's just anything goes here and that's problematic when you're dealing with your money so with that said that's all we have time for now there's nothing else really to discuss just want to uh remind you that bulls make money bears make money but pigs get slaughtered so take what you can and give nothing back <laughs>